this is a quick video on how uh, you can record yourself singing a parody okay um, now there are a couple of different ways um, whether you can record it on uh, DB or you can use um, thing called audacity which I'm hoping should be on your computers okay now the problem is I did find that uh, when I had my YouTube uh, clip open and I had it playing uh, it wasn't really getting the music um, so I did have to have an iPad or a phone playing the music um, and then that way there it was getting into the speakers so I don't mind which way you do it <clears throat> if you haven't got a second device just have that music going uh, in the background now I may not be able to hear the music but at least I'll be able to hear the words um, to it okay so either way you can do it all right but as I said when you have when you have it going in YouTube in the background for some reason I, I wasn't really picking up the audio yours might be different but but mine wasn't so I had to have my iPad playing the the karaoke version of my song um, and then I was recording it all right so this is how you can do it two ways so um, you go to my work and then you click new and you put sound clip okay and then you'll obviously name it um, up here in the title uh, so whatever your song's name is so mine will be test parody okay uh, then obviously uh, once once you get once you have your lyrics there ready to go um, then you get your karaoke version on YouTube um, or you can get the real versions totally up to you um, then what you do is you press this button here which is record okay so I've got my music going <clears throat> I've got my lyrics ready so then I'll press this it starts recording so I go boom 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 all right I'll start singing then once I'm finished I just click stop and see so it'll do that for you starts recording okay boom all right so then you see how that sort of played then what you do is you just click save okay and that is in your work all right and I'll show you that later now the other way you can do it is through audacity so you go down to here on your computer down the bottom left hand corner um, you click on the little screen and up will come this now under the audio and video in your apps okay is a thing called audacity and you'll scroll down and it's this one here okay so you just click on that and something like this will come up okay now the way to record um, is you just press this little red button up here that says record okay so once again once I've got my YouTube going in the background I've got my lyrics ready I'm ready to go I'll just press record then I'll start do, 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 do. now when I'm finished I'll just click stop okay and that there's your song then you can listen to it again all right now the difference with this one here is you've got to go up here to file file and you've got to go to export okay so I go to export and make sure that it, down here it says mp3 file um, and then file name I'll just put test already now see up here it shows me where it's saving it in so I'm saving it in my downloads um, you save it wherever you want but sort of just make sure this is an mp3 file um, and then you just click save don't have to worry about any of this just click OK all right and then that's your thing saved um, then you can just click out of it and we don't want to save the changes no okay now the way to upload it um, okay so obviously we go back here to my home page and find the task of parity so that'll be here because I can upload any file that I want all right so I'll click there all right 
Now, obviously, here I've given you a bit of a, um, this is my parody up here um, that you can listen to. And there obviously there'll be a video there. So there's two ways um, you can do this. So you've already got your work here. Uh, so basically, you've got to go find test parody. So here you see I've got test parody. All you do is, it's the same as uploading your times tables. You'll click on test parity. Um, and then you'll click on choose. And then it'll prompt you to um, to save it. Okay. Now, so that's one way. Because if, if you've done it through DB, so that's how you would do it on DB. Whereas if you do it through Audacity, you just click on upload. Okay. And see how I'm in downloads already. Um, here's my test parity. I'll just click on that. And it's just uploaded automatically. Okay, so um, when you're doing it straight from your computer, it just uploads automatically and you finish the task. Whereas if you're doing it through my work here on DB, um, there'll be a couple of steps before you actually 100% finish the task. Um, so that's the way that I'd like to do it. See so here you go. I would really enjoy listening to um, some of your parodies, seeing as um, I did mine. Um, but hopefully uh, you can do that. So see so here we go.